All right, today I'll show you how to disassemble and reassemble a BlackBerry 300 series phone. This is the same series for or the same process for any 8300 series. I'll be using a T4 screwdriver, two millimeter flathead, and a cell phone prying tool. So let's start with the two up top. Then I take the um, two millimeter flathead to get the bottom clip off. You can use a prying tool or whatever. I use it just to get started. Pop it out like that. Grab it at the bottom. Be careful not to break it. it does sound like it's going to break, but it's not. As you can see, the four tabs are still intact. So there's that. Now we'll take the prying tool and go along the edge. There's two tabs, one there, one there. Okay. Keyboard. This housing stuck. All right. <clears throat> so there's the housing. Now there's four more screws. Let me see what size those are. So those are T6s. Four T six, four T six screws. Go ahead and loosen these. Now you can take off the side rails. Sorry, I'm going fast. Got to make sure I stay within the 10 minutes. Okay. <clears throat> now this part right here, this metal framing lifts up. So does the keyboard. What's keeping the keyboard intact is just adhesive. Excuse me, let me see if I could show that to you. So you can see where all the dirt's at. It's right there on the adhesive. So you can either take it off or I just tip it up. Then you just tip. Go ahead and, yeah. Go ahead and tip that up. If it's stuck, just pry it a little. All right, so now we'll move it from the back chassis. So you lift that up. And to get it off, there's a little tab, so you gotta... There you go. Then to get the screen off, you pop this tab. And should be held by some sort of adhesive, which it is. Can you hear it come off? 
There's your screen. Now you just got your PCB board. I'll show you real quick how to remove these trackballs. I got it in another video. But I'll go ahead and do it again for this one. Oh no, this little... Okay. So even on this one, on the 8350 series, you actually have to remove the trackball from behind. But on this one, it's like all the other ones. You can do it from the front. So nothing really to show there. I can show it to you after we put the phone back together. So now we'll reassemble it. Starting with the screen. Let's make sure you get that back in there. Give the screen a good wipe with a lint free cloth. I use microfiber cloth. So that's removed. Let's get this metal housing back on it. Just like that. I'm going to go kind of quick on this. Just the keyboard. Get it back in the back chassis. Then we want to get these rails back on. So we could. Go ahead and install the T6 screws. You don't want to do it too tight. Okay. And go ahead and switch back to your T. I'm running out of time here. Put your housing back on. Make sure your tabs aren't crooked. Just putting it back on, you could break it and to get a new housing. back in it's all in place go ahead and put those two in okay put the bottom housing clip back on Sure it's set in flush. And that is how you disassemble and reassemble BlackBerry 8300 series.